Welcome to Medicine Medicine. This session is all about injury and we are discussing about abrasion today. Let's get started. Abrasion is a superficial injury involving superficial layer of skin. It occurs as a result of friction between any surface and skin. Talking about types of abrasion, we have scratch abrasion, grease abrasion, pressure abrasion and impact abrasion. The direction of force causing friction may be horizontal or tangential as seen in scratch and grease abrasion or may be perpendicular as seen in pressure and imprint abrasion. Talking about features of abrasion, abrasion is superficial injury with slight bleeding but it is painful due to exposure of nerve endings and it is one of the reason why abrasion might be accidental and homicidal but it is rarely suicidal. Abrasion heals rapidly and there is no scar formation. Now we will be discussing about each type of abrasion here. Scratch abrasion. It is produced by pointed objects such as fingernail, thorn, pin. The injury has significant length but no significant width. Next type of abrasion is grease abrasion. It is produced when broader area of body is dragged against rough surface. It is most common type of abrasion and usually seen in road traffic accident. Pressure abrasion. It is produced as a result of direct impact or pressure over the skin. The best example being ligature mark seen in hanging and strangulation. Next kind of abrasion is impact abrasion which is produced as a result of impact with a rough surface that is when force is applied at right angle to the skin. Example is patterned abrasion due to vehicle tire. In case of impact abrasion, the impact being forcible damages the dermis and is presented with an underlying bruise. Abrasions heal from periphery by new growth of epithelial cells. You can take a pause here and note down the age of abrasion. Now the most important part that is medical legal significance of abrasion. Abrasion are simple injuries but might be grievous as in case of corneal abrasion. Abrasion are usually accidental or homicidal but rarely suicidal. One can ascertain the direction of force by looking at abrasion. Similarly, purpose of injury can be explained by looking at abrasion, such as abrasion due to ligature explains hanging and strangulation, while abrasion due to nail mark explains throttling, smothering or sexual offense. Abrasion distribution can explain the offense caused, such as fingernail abrasion over neck explains throttling and abrasion over mouth and nose explains smothering and abrasion on breast genitals and thighs of female explains sexual offense. Also, time of injury can be roughly assessed through abrasion. We hope we could help you a bit. If you liked our video, please like, comment, share and subscribe.